How's it going everyone, Brotosams here and today we're going to be taking a quick look at the state and progress of PlayStation Vita emulation on PC. So PS Vita emulator called Vita 3K uh, between uh, January 2022 and May 2022 has increased the number of supported games from 573 games to 582 games and back in January 2022 the number of playable games was only 39 but today in May 2022 it became 68 games so that's an increase of 30 games you can also click on the uh, tag or category of playable so you can check uh, the list of uh, playable games there's this one uh, PlayStation Vita full exclusive called Shinobido 2 that you can now play on the uh, emulator and uh, it's kind of smooth. You could also check the uh, playable uh, 68 playable games. Uh, as you can see, it's a big list. So that's a uh, good progress. In six months, we got uh, 30 games, 30 more games being added uh, to the playable category and actually becoming playable. Also, the number of games that go in game has been increased from only 80 games to 88. This means that the games that used to go only to menu and then uh, nothing happens after that, those games now go in-game and you can actually uh, go in-game and no longer only uh, stay in the menu. Like I'm gonna show you, Uncharted only boots into the menu. It doesn't go in-game. So now games that go in-game are more than games that uh, go only to the uh, menu and there's nothing after that. Also the number of games that do nothing, they don't boot, they don't go to the uh, uh, menu, they don't, uh, th there's nothing. That number of games has been decreased from 197 to only 177. So 20 games are now bootable or go into menu or go into game. So uh, the more this number of uh, and this tag of nothing decreases, the better that's it uh, for now and i'm gonna leave you with a video uh, of testing some games running on the emulator and uh, you can check the uh, uh, performance on the top left corner of the screen
こんな不穏な状況だ。はあ、ふざけるな。ま、女に恨まれるのは慣れっこだからね。お前が止めたの。好きに。
Yeah. 